I can tell you more money was spent on Proposal P than any of the other Detroit City races, including the race for mayor. Inside here is the watch party for incumbent mayor Mike Duggan. He's leading easily in his primary race, running for a third term. He is among those who had said Proposal P was going to be too costly. There was too much in it that it could bankrupt the city. We found some voters also concerned about how much it would cost them. Some of the things in it I didn't agree with, um, specifically like when it comes to probably end up having to raise taxes. Proposal P. Normally voter turnout in an off year municipal election would be about 15 percent, but Proposal P could change that. So much discussion about it leading up to the vote. The proposal is 150 pages. I did research. I read a couple other people's opinions on it. They see what they thought of it, and um, I went with uh, my conscience after that. It's 150 pages. You didn't read the whole thing. Did I did you? not read the a whole <laughs> thing. Definitely not. Proposal P would change the balance of power between the strong mayor and the city council, and proponents say more citizen oversight including with elections. There's been a lot of talk for quite some time about there being a conflict of interest with the clerk counting the votes and actually running in that election. So we'll have an election commission. Opponents say the revised charter goes way too far and put on a strong campaign to vote no. The concern is who's in charge. I mean, a, a two-headed monster is unstable. Uh, we have a, a strong mayor form of government. Now, if you want to change the form of government, Governance put that in the charter. We found some voters confused by it all. You had to do a lot of reading. You know, the little blurbs that they give you, sometimes it's not enough. So you just have to do your own research and read upon it yourself. I didn't do much homework. My wife did it. So <laughs> <laughs> I didn't do much. So I followed her direction. You know what I mean? You're honest. <laughs> so again, this was a yes or no, up or down vote. It's losing by about a two to one margin. This was two and a half years in the making. Voters in November of 2018 authorized our Charter Revision Commission, but the work all done for now. On the east side of Detroit, Jim Kurtzner, 7 Action News. All right, thank you.